Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. In this episode, I'm going to demonstrate to you how you can remediate a web view error called ERR, clear text not permitted, like shown on the screen here. Uh, this normally happens when you try to launch a web page using web view in your Xamarin and you can't really see any pages. Let me show you what I mean by that. I've got a Visual Studio here. I've got a phone, my phone here. I'm remotely mirroring the phone here on my phone. So uh, what I'm doing is that I have a button uh, in this simple page here. So this button will actually trigger and launch this page here. This content page is a web view page trying to load yahoo.com, right? So I'm just going to close all this and I'm going to run this on my uh, mobile phone here. So in a moment, you know, my mobile phone will be presented with the running app and this, this button here at the bottom here, openwebviewyahoo.com. If I click on it, this is the error message that you get, error clear text not permitted. Let me show you how you can remediate this error. I'm going to have to stop this for now. It's a very simple fix. You just have to make a flag in your Android manifest to true. So. This is your Xamarin folder. Go to Android. Expand this Android folder. Go to Properties here. Go to Android Manifest. Double click this to open it. And under the application here, you see Android label your application name. Over here, you want to insert Android, okay, colon, users clear text traffic and in this parameter flag you're gonna set this to true once that's done you save it and then uh, we're gonna keep this open here for a sec here so all you added was this one here let me zoom in so you can see it properly here just like that right under the application flag just like that so with this, it will still run, but uh, there's another option that you're going to have to enable, but let's run it for now. As you can see, I'm running right now. You will run without any problem. Just give it a moment here. There we go. The app is coming. When I click on this one here now, the Yahoo page will load and it's all fine. Uh, one more thing you should set, although it works here right now, but for, for actual Google Play deployment, you should also put the internet access here. So on this Android here, right click, go properties, and you go manifest, and you go scroll all the way down here, and look for the text called internet. You should enable this, so you give them permission to access the internet. So you're gonna have to close it by, you're gonna have to save it by pressing Control S and close it. And then for the final test, just for your own verification, you can see this this line is added now because you put a check mark for the internet, right? And your clear text is still there. Let's go ahead and click play. Give it a few seconds to build. And then uh, we'll come to that same button there to navigate to uh, web view on yahoo.com. There you go. And now if you click on the button here, if it comes up here momentarily, here we go. Click on this here, you'll have your Yahoo web page on your Android app and you can scroll, you can do whatever you want. If this tutorial is helpful, please like and subscribe. Thank you and we'll have a good day. Bye now.